In this video, I'm going to look at solving this equation. Now, really, uh, this equation won't be too difficult to solve given what we already know, but it's what we get at the end that is important to consider. So there's a checking bit at the end. So first of all, the log x plus 1 and the log x, they can be combined using the first log law. So the two get multiplied together, so we have log of x plus 1 times x, so x squared plus x is going to be equal to log of 6. You can then e both sides to get x squared plus x is equal to 6. Okay, so take 6 from both sides and then factorise. So either x is minus 3 or x is 2 from these two brackets. However, there is a problem here because we cannot have x equals minus 3 as a solution because you can't take log of a negative number. And so you must make sure that you refer back to the original problem to see if your answers actually make sense, if they actually work. The minus 3 does not make sense, it does not work, and so that is not a solution. However, the x equals 2 does work, and that is the only solution to this equation. 